Guys, <clears throat> so behind me is what's it called Bell Classic. It's a uh, modern wedding chapel. And uh, one thing that's interesting about Japan in 2014, and even when I first came here in 2008, um, that's the year I got married, um, the traditional Japanese wedding has definitely lost a lot of its popularity. Um, getting married at a shrine, you'll see the traditional wedding. A uh, Japanese bride wears a white kimono with a large white headpiece. The, the, the groom wears a black kimono. And uh, that, those are not going the way of the dodo, but they're definitely, they're a lot less popular than before for a few reasons. And these kind of modern wedding halls where they have these kind of pseudo-American weddings, kind of like what, what, what Japanese people think is kind of like a, a Western style wedding. It's kind of a weird hybrid thing. If, if you're from Canada, America and you go to see a Japanese wedding at one of these places, you will be kind of scratching your head and thinking, that's a bit weird. Um, nice, but a bit weird. And um, that's because it seems to be like, a, it's, it's definitely more stylish to have this kind of Western style wedding. A lot of young Japanese women, um, and not so young, um, prefer it. They want the big white dress and they want yeah, that style. Um, they think it's cooler because of, I guess, American cinema, TV, all that kind of thing. But also, a big kicker, it's, it's a lot less expensive to get married at a wedding hall or a hotel. Um, getting married at a shrine, a traditional wedding, is a lot more expensive. Even for a small number of people, it's very expensive. So, um, yeah, so there you go. Uh, sort of with the lens flare behind you guys, but uh, modern wedding halls here in Japan becoming much more popular. Yeah. Later, guys. Um, check out all the links below if you're interested in Japan. Go check out my podcast, Just Japan Podcast. It's probably something you're going to like. Uh, the links for that are below as well. Later. You can find it on iTunes and Stitcher, by the way.